Uh, well, my name is Jonathan Tankel. I am a college professor in Indiana, in the States, and I do, we're on, <laughs> we're, um, what I do is I teach media at the college level. I also work with access producers to develop uh, media literacy programs to be able to uh, deal with adults and the question of access, open channels, and what people know about media. Since media techniques are universal, um, rather than begin by talking about difference, we talk, begin by talking about the sameness. And from there, then the specific cultural use of any particular type of media technique it has an intellectual foundation and people understand it uh, and understand that what they're doing is important for them and that they don't have to follow any particular pattern, any particular mimic, any other kind of media. They should know how they do it, but then they should know how to tell their own stories and, get, and that we hope that this will give them the power to tell their own stories. My name is... Eric Malberg, and uh, I operate three open channels in Fort Wayne, Indiana, uh, two for the public and one is a local government channel. I've been doing community media or open channel work since um, 1982. I've also served on uh, the National Organization for Access Television. Well, I, th I think it's critical for the open channels to uh, certainly be involved with each other if we're going to be talking about uh, intercultural dialogue simply because of the globalization of media that has been going on on the commercial interest. I think now is an even more critical time for the open channels worldwide to get together and to be able to not only communicate our messages, but to be able to communicate to each other and our and uh, all of our local residents, so they have a better understanding. Because whatever's happening in the states is happening in Europe, and the issues that you're facing are the same ones that we are as well. So it's it's uh, of vital importance that we we keep these lines open because uh, uh, the the traditional commercial media is not going to do that. They're simply going to deliver their message and what they think is important instead of what is important to our communities.